Welcome everyone, it's RP Jimmy, and it's time for a Let's Try. And for this episode of a Let's Try, we have my friend Josiah. How are you doing, Josiah? I'm doing alright, Jimmy. How are you doing? I'm doing okay. We're going to lower the volume a little bit on this. We're going to try Chris Tales. Don't know anything about this. Uh, how do you feel about this opening? It's very colorful. Kind of I like it. Clearly a western based game with Japanese influence. Chris Tales. Alright, so the usual rules for Let's Tries for me is that, you know, I do at least 10 to 15 minutes um, due to the fact that I am with someone else that is increased by two. So we're going to do at least 20 to 25 minutes. Um, and so here we go. I mean, I probably should have checked the options, but who cares? I have no experience about from this game at all, obviously. It's called a Let's Try. Let me a little higher a bit, because I can't really hear it. Alright, so already we are being confronted. We are Chris Bell. They're trying to reach this the town. Real fight, Chris Bell. Time to use your new skills. A apparently our friend is a frog named Matthias. <laughs> be swift, yeah. Be Matthias. Matthias, yeah. Alright, first select attack. Just as the attack connects, press the button one more time to do a double slash. Ooh, double okay. slash. Attack. Okay. So turn-based combat. Uh, that's my. F that's actually my favorite form of combat in RPGs. Me too. Oh, it's time too. Okay. So yeah, I failed that first. Let's let's try it again. There you go. Be cautious. Watch for your opponent's attack and press the button right when they hit you to block most of the damage. Okay. Voiceover quality is nice. Careful, Chris Bell. I missed. There we go. Now, give it your all. Finish it Oh, we had to press X to defend there too, didn't you? Yep. Okay. Active defense, that's interesting. Time-based defense. I like that. Easily a mechanic to uh, bring some strategy and uh, get to pay attention to the battles. Who are you supposed to be? Oh, Christopher now is here. Tell me if we survive. You know how to fight? Let us show you. So, I guess I'm Christopher now? Oh no, I'm still Chris... Chris Bell. Oh, okay, it swaps in and out. Yes, I guess on... yeah, for each turn. I, I, I'm, I'm guessing up and down sw swaps you back and forth as well. I haven't had to swap at all, but we'll find out, I'm sure. Yeah. Okay, I guess we'll just keep fighting these guys. Yeah, no, I assume the directional pad or the joystick allows you to pick your target if there's two or yes. more. Yes! Okay. Well, actually, in my case, I'm just the joy pads doing that. Right. All right, so quick predictions. Who's the frog? Um, I don't... Uh, okay, maybe... Uh... Let's go for an out there. It's the villain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this. A two-headed person. Never mind. Oh, no, it's not a two-headed person. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. They're next to each other. It's not two-headed. All right, so there. There's two less of them. Been chasing those things since I left St. Clarity. We've got to stop them before they reach town. It does look like they're conjoined, at least. Yeah. And exactly how do you plan to do that? Who names their per their who? Why is their name Volcano? I mean, you know, when the parents when the parents chose the name for the child, they just knew it would have some explosive rage. Do you do you do you think that there's a chance that they were given birth to in a volcano, and that might be the reason why? And and thus, I mean, there's fire all around them as well, so it may as well be. We've talked about this. No more pets until... Until I stop murdering them. I know, I know. Gally? Where is that? Yeah, it's Gally. Not my fault they're all so squishy. <laughs> and that's why we can't have nice things. Do they want my frog? 
Uh, 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 I mean, I mean, technically, uh, human beings that can be squishy. So, ooh, guarding. Okay. We can't touch them. Okay, so then what do you want him? To oh, because he gets, he can do water bubble. Okay. And that didn't do anything either. Uh oh. Took one hit. It is time. Use the crystals. The crystals. Well, this is called Crystallis, so I guess crystals make sense here. I think we're gonna see a lot of Chris words, cause we have Christopher, Chris Bell. And Chris, yeah. Oh, there's and Chris Tails. Chris Tails. Where's Chris Cross? Maybe. As I said, when you said Crystallis, uh, that, that's an old NES RPG. Are we getting a... Before all of this happened, before the town was seemingly destroyed? Because I am kind of surprised they just jumped right in without even giving a backstory or anything. Yeah, I imagine this will be like one of those two weeks earlier or something thing. Yeah. Hey, that was the frog. So the frog stole a rose. I guess the frog is a villain, because he's a thief! <laughs> Alright. Yeah, so I guess we're in the- I assume we're in the past here. Before the town was destroyed. So yep, now I'm- I'm controlling Christelle. I miss your grandma, Chris. And how it used to be around here. Well, you're not gonna like how it turns out, I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> <laughs> Where's this fro- is this him? If I pick every strawberry right now, maybe I won't have to do it ever again. Okay, thanks, good, good to know. Where'd that damn frog go? Oh, uh, uh, he, he ran away. Maybe I just have to speak to- Mother Superior. Mother Superior. Wow. Finally. Also, probably a villain. Maybe she is responsible for what's going to happen. You don't think it's weird that the frog was wearing a hat? Enough, enough. Really unusual. I've seen that look before. Find that rose, then hurry back. There's work to do and no time to waste. Go on. Yes, Mother Superior. Thank you, Mother Superior. And be careful. I worry about you. Calling someone Mother Superior is odd. <laughs> yeah, I wonder what the reason is. Well, maybe, is it possible that this is an orphanage? That's, yeah, actually, I thought about that. Because there are two girls in this garden right now. And there's... There's one on the right, yeah, and, yeah. And then look at how many windows there are, though, because it could all be bedrooms. Right, yeah. and that, that one on the right, that's, uh, I think that's, um... There you go, that one, yeah. as well. Yeah, okay, yeah, this has to be an orphanage. And this Mother Superior, I think, was a title given to, uh, to uh, women in charge of orphanages, so it fits. Right. My current objective is to find a frog, I thought. <laughs> that's what we were doing. Let's see. Well, yes, and that's the frog. Alright, so here we are. Let's go around town. See what's going on. This game, this game is stylistically gorgeous. Yes. Oh. What? North. Oh, this is our... Oh, yeah, there we go. It is an <laughs> orphanage. Yeah, it is an orphanage. Orphanage yeah. confirmed. But this doesn't yeah, really tell me where the frog is. That's titled Mother What's Superior, that? although I'd still find it awkward to call someone that. Have you seen a little yellow frog? Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, so she did know she did mention the top hat, great. Uh, top hat? Then no. Maybe try the mayor's estate. 
There's always something going on there. Including frogs wearing top hats, apparently. Thanks, Marco. Sorry to bother. Are you kidding? That's the most interesting thing out here all day. Wow. Uh, so wait, where is this? Uh, is it? Uh, I guess it's up. I'm gonna assume it's up. That's the cathedral. I still have to find that frog. So I'm gonna assume south. Okay. Oh, let me see what these. Check out the cool sticker we found. It's a skull. Wait, what is going on? In oh, it looked like the kid was feeding the other kid a uh, a popsicle. <laughs> I, it might be. <laughs> no, I think I think it's the. the oh no, you're right. It's yeah, different skin color. So yeah, it's just the overlap of the arm. It's just like the uh, like volcano. I really <laughs> thought it was two people conjoined together. All right, what's this say? North Cathedral. So the exit is south. Oh, Mayor's yeah, Estate just... is east. All right, so let's just go east. From where you're at right now, yeah. So let's let's try. So I'm not gonna talk to everybody. Look at this guy. Hold on, talk to him. Think about the future. It's not just the farms that will be renovated. His voice does not match his face. <laughs> Your future follows the land, poisons the water. Goblin raiding parties. This place is what I expected. <laughs> Money, power, your precious industry. That's all you care about now. How dare you? Where's your proof? Proof? Look around you. Look at our crops. Then sell your lands, Robert. Don't let it trouble you any longer. It's what's best for the town. It's best for someone, but not the town. You seem to be doing just fine. Drop me here. See here. I never... Mr. Mayor, we have a visitor. Hello, Crisco. What do you want? Hello, Miss Lana. I was looking for a yellow frog with a top hat. Of course you were. Try the northern fields. That's where all the little pests go, hmm? May the lady light your way, Crisco. Too many in town have strayed from my This guy's a real bummer. <laughs> oh, thank you. Go. And and the, I don't know, man. The the mayor, a dude that big. Oh, with, there he is. Yep, with that voice, just doesn't sound. Uh, do you think he's a, he? Do you think he's fake? Do you like meaning? Do you think? Wait, where would he go? They said check the fields, so that would be south. Outside, outside the town. Oh, to never mind. No, I'm wrong. Okay, so let me go back to him and ask him again. Yeah, probably best. This will be the no, this will be a new face of town. Hey, lady, like... No. Oh, you're still here. <laughs> the disdain in her voice. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry she for existing, man. Like volcano as well. What's this? Anything? Treasure chest. Oh. Healing juice. <laughs> By the way, did you notice the picture of the healing juice had a straw? Yes, I did. Yeah. Okay. Can't go that way. I wonder if there was a run button here. No, nope, this is this. Secretary Lana told me to go oh. check out the farms. I don't think she was serious about it, but it's still worth a shot. Yeah, clearly she does no, not like that we exist. So let's see where the farms are. I mean, I thought you were right. I thought it said it was south, but let's check the sign. Well, it, it said it said like no, northern something or other, but I figured that would be outside of town because the way it said. I mean, we so, have a farm area where we were at the orphanage. That, that's true. Well, it's not letting me go there, so it's not there. <laughs> uh, I want to check the sign again. Oh, oh, oh like... east. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Oh, here we go. That looks like a farm. Hi, Polly. How are things? I don't know, Chris. Between the crops, the monsters, the weather... It never ends. I just saw your dad with the mayor. It sounds like an average day in Canada. <laughs> Again, I Especially the monsters. Trust the mayor. We need it, but it's always... We give the lady our trust. Everyone else has to earn it. 
Sorry, Chris. What's up? I'm looking for a little yellow frog. He was wearing a hat. A top hat. He took my rose. A frog in a top hat? Only you, Chris Bell. I haven't seen it, but I'll keep my eyes open. Thanks, Polly. Maybe I should pray to the lady about it. <laughs> you have been talking to my father. Well, if you're looking for a miracle, I suppose the cathedral is as good a place as any to try. Okay, so I guess instead of going for the frog now, we're gonna pray. Oh, there he is. You know what? I would give this game so much credit if all of a sudden, at some point in this game, you like get a close up of the frog and he does the song from uh, the frog from Looney Tunes. <laughs> <laughs> hello, my baby. Hello, my darling. Hello, my ragtime gal. He's right there. How did you not see him? Overwhelmed by the majesty of the stained glass. Oh, what? She got the rose back. There he is. Yep. Michigan J Frog, that's the name, by the way. I was trying to think what his name was from Looney Tunes. Right. Did only one of her eyes just move? <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Actually, you are. <gasps> there he is. The crystals of time, Chris Bell. <laughs> what are... I mean, who... How do you know my name? So many questions. Matthias the Frog at your service. I have been keeping an eye on you for some time now. On me? Why? I suspected you had been chosen, my dear. It appears I was correct. Chosen? By whom? She's hearing from frogs. Yeah, she's been chosen for the insane asylum. <laughs> More questions. Oh, that would be great. Like all of a sudden she does the um, the Michigan J Frog thing where you remember those cartoons, right? Or no? Oh, yeah. Of like, course. like where the, the frog will sing for the guy exclusively because then once he shows someone that it just drops down. <laughs> yep, yep. That should be what happens here. In the future, have revealed themselves to you. Come, see for yourself. I can't. I don't want this. Nothing to fear, child. You have much to learn about your powers. Powers? This is a curse. Why is this even happening? You're jumping to conclusions pretty quickly, there. <laughs> I, I agree. But I know someone who can help. He lives in a little hut down by the lake. Oh, what's this character gonna look like? Deep town. Mother Superior will worry. She would be very worried if she saw you like this. Is it another talking frog? No, no way. Only. But sadly, no. Trust me, little one. Let us go immediately. This was a, a far cry from the You're a wizard, Harry! Yeah. situation. Harry was eager for to, to be... Move to Hogwarts. Chris Bell appears quite very happy. Unhappy I mean, it with her new. I mean, it doesn't seem like her life's great anyway, right now. To be honest with you. Living in an orphanage ain't all that great. Yeah. You can save your game while in the overworld. Just open the menu, and select the save option. Remember to save often. I'm not going to, cause Zoya. Let's try. We're gonna go to the hut, and then that might be like pretty much the end of this video. Like I said, folks, it's a let's try. But I always, I will say this, I am always open to if all of a sudden this miraculously gets, you know, 10,000 likes overnight, then guess what? Looks like we might be continuing with Chris Bell. It, it's, uh, I, I would say, at least uh, from my initial impressions, that I'm pretty sure it's a game I would enjoy. Yeah. Um, uh, I, I don't know if I would go out of my way mm -hmm. to play it. 
but it does look like the kind of like easy playing RPG that I would really like. Yeah, I wonder how long yeah. the, how long, like what an average. Don't look it up right now. We'll look it up offline. But I'm curious because it, it feels like this should be this will probably be a short game. Yeah, I, I can't see it being more than like twenty hours. Like the like an older RPG. All right, so let's guess. What is this person gonna look like? Is it gonna be an animal? Is it gonna be? Is it gonna be an old wizard-like man? Is it going to be something we can't even describe? Dude, also with a hat. Another guy with a guy with a hat, like the like the frog has. Yes. I'm gonna say it's gonna be an old wizard guy. A hat, a hat of some kind. All right, I'm gonna say it's gonna be an old wizard guy. Let's see. Let's find out. Will yeah. Helm. With a name like that, he's definitely. Old. Busy. Oh, voice is young. Okay. You're a child. Manners. You're speaking to a revered time mage. Now, who might you be? Crispell. Um, sir? Crispell has opened both crystals of time. Ridiculous. Impossible. Why not even I have been able to? Yet it has happened. No. No, no, no. There's something else at work here. Can someone please tell me what's going on? Patience. I am Wilhelm the Wise. Wilhelm the Wise. As am I. And while my powers have led to my youthful appearance, yours are the gift to see possibility. So it is an old guy. Yeah, it is. He just stays young forever, apparently. Or appearance-wise. Wears a scarf, not a hat, either. <laughs> Perhaps a practical demonstration will help. Take this seed and plant it over there. The seed was added to your bag. Uh, no, we gotta see what the seed is now. I need to see what this is all about. Inst Whoa. Instinct grow, apparently. No water needed. Oh, I see how. Okay. Tell me, what do you see in the future? A tree. It's growing from the seed I planted. Exactly. A glow fruit tree, to be specific. But take care. It will only grow if you care for it. Otherwise, it will wither and die. Well, that's bad news for the tree, then, for me. So I'm not someone who has a green thumb. I can affect the future. Obviously. Has that not always been the case? Now, however, you have the ability to see future possibilities. So choose your actions accordingly. That is an interesting mechanic. They'll be wondering where I've gone. Thank you, Wilhelm. Yes, yes, go to your sisters. You've given me much to ponder, young mage. So either I'm not paying attention. What what are you getting from this exactly? So the triangle you see on the screen yeah. shows you the future. So the, so the, those haven't grown yet. Mm -hmm. Now if you, if you walk to the right or the left and the triangle's off the screen, you'll see that what the present is. That's the oh, present. Oh, okay. Yes. So oh. it, it, within the triangle, you're seeing the future. That's crazy. Okay, let's go and see. And, and so decisions that you make, or like, oh, look at that. What? Oh, I got it now. The right is the future. The left is the present. Or, uh, the middle is the present. Go, 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 the left is the past. The middle is the present. Uh -huh. so, yeah, so see? nothing's grown. I'm looking at the thing in the back. That's now grown. And it's bigger on the right screen. Yes, okay. Right. I see. And and so, so if you go to go to the right again, you'll see the fully grown tree right oh, there. Here, right. Oh, yeah, yeah, on the right side, yeah. Present, it's just seedling. And on the left, if you go go, go further to the right, yeah, there's that's nothing the there. past, where before you planted it. Right, and yeah, because look, even Wilhelm's no longer there on the left screen. William, right, Wilhelm's exactly. there in the middle, but he's not there and, on the right because he's probably not standing there all the time. Yes, and so you need to cultivate and care for the tree. Why don't you press the X on the tree and see if you can care for it? This is where I planted the seed Wilhelm gave me. No, it doesn't let you do anything. What's now, I, depending on your actions, the one on the right can change. Okay, 
By the way, I don't know if you so, noticed, there's a hint thing on the upper left. Just can't use this right now, I don't think, but... Right. Uh, but that's an interesting mechanic. And then I noticed on the upper left, there's a hint section. And then she tells you where you should go. Yes. Alright, so let's walk around town and see what the past, present, and future is. That is, that is fascinating. Although maybe it doesn't only works on that section. We'll find out. Yeah, maybe it only works selectively. Well, we'll stick around for this for a couple more minutes now that we found this. Okay, yeah, look. So those people on the left. Um, If I move to the right. Yeah, there she is. She's an adult now. Oh my gosh, and that then, is so cool. Look, she's old as hell there. That is so cool. Now, look, the, the, I guess someone died on the left. Maybe it's her... Some parent, because I don't think they are there in the future. Grandfather or something. Yeah, yeah and then there's a tombstone. Or not a tombstone, it's just not there. Yeah, okay. what, about, what about these people? Let's take a look. There's the baby. There's the mother. Oh, that's the mother, okay. And then there's the mother with the baby, and then... Her with a, a growing child. Okay. So let's this so this one, just a woman, older woman. Uh, doesn't let you go right enough. All right, we'll stick with this for another few minutes here just to see what the orphanage is gonna look like. No, how could this happen? Matthias, what? Oh, was it? It's dead. Uh, uh, oh yeah, in the future it's dead. No, it's. What do you mean? I mean, it's still here. Oh, oh gosh. Wait, yeah. so hold on. This is oh, but, but young is her. Child. There's her there. I mean, she's still around. Hmm. What about this girl? Is she just an adult or just... <gasps> Does she not live? I wonder she, if that's... Anyway, she's, not, she's not there in the future. And she wasn't there in the past. And then, is, what about things over here? Right, there's... I mean, you're right, okay, I see what you're saying, though. Like, it's... It's not a full like... bloom as it is in the in the future, but I wouldn't say it's dead. No, no, I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say that either. All right, let's see what Mother Superior is like. Bell, you had me worried. Mother Superior, you're okay. The orphanage is still here. Well, of course. What's got you so excited, child? Did something happen? No, I mean, not yet. I went to get my rose, then Matthias showed me how I could... Matthias? Yes, he... he was just here. I need to find him. He's pulling a Michigan J Frog. Please <laughs> give me the rose you spent all morning looking for. Yes, Mother Superior. Now, go find your friend. And don't take all day. You still have to prune these roses. I wonder, can you can you actually prune some of the roses? How do I do that? What, what do you mean? So uh, on the on the right, that's where the roses were in the field in the present. This right? So, no, no. Oh, you got to go into the field. But yeah. Okay, so in the field. Those are the roses there. All right, so oh, oh, you're asking if it lets me do anything. Right. It doesn't, right. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, the purple ones aren't roses, but the, the, uh... Oh, oh, the, the red, red thing. Okay. Red ones, yeah. Oh, let me go. No, it doesn't okay. do anything. Okay, it doesn't actually let you do anything, no. okay. And you can see in the future all the seedlings are gone. Oh, like the, yeah, 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 I see. Yeah, it's an empty so, field. So that's, that's interesting. Okay. And the trees don't have leaves on them. Oh, yeah, I didn't notice that. See, you know, you're noticing way more than I am, that's for sure. I, I, I tend to be very observant when it comes to video games, and I like, like, exploring every nook and cranny. And, uh... I thought it best not to upset your mother superior with the appearance of a talking frog. You know, that's fair. <laughs> Chris Bell, I am sorry if I upset you by leaving. No, I mean, yes, but it's the orphanage. I saw its future. Abandoned. Empty. Could that... I do not know, but let us look around town. Perhaps your new powers can shed Wait, this is gonna, they're going to somehow, just me walking around is going to tell the story of what happened to the orphanage? Apparently. 
All right, well, let's check the fields. Let's see. I have a feeling that's the route. I mean, the fields are all empty oh, in the future. There's what? They, they, they look dead in the future as well. Yeah. Or at least harvested. Wait, what's this? Oh. I got a flask of feathers. Great. <laughs> uh, this is as far as I could go on the right. Okay. The last thing I'm going to check before we end the video is I want to check the um, the mayor. Yeah, that's that's a good call. That's actually what I was going to suggest. I, I'm, I, this is something new. That... You're looking at the future there. Look, the town looks kind of rough. And only if you let it happen. If I let it happen? But... No, you're right. Looks like she's starting to accept her burden. Yeah. Alright, so let's see if these people are still around. I mean, yeah, they... Well, one of them is. Yeah, it's, uh... What's her face? Well, I guess what? maybe because she takes over. Hmm. Surprisingly, that guy's still around. Let me see if I talk to them if anything happens. Well, let me talk to her, since she's the one that's still around. Oh, you're still... Okay. And the mayor is gone in the future. Yeah, but the house still looks like it's there. And in better condition? I would argue, yeah. Yeah, I would say yeah. better condition. So it sounds like uh, whoever's in charge was enriching themselves in the future. Yeah. And let the rest of the town rot. And then let's see what if anything changes over here. He gets older, he's gone. Who is he anyway? I don't think we talked to him. Yeah, yeah. Good morning. Carpenter yes. Joe. Can you help me? There's a problem with the houses. A problem? Great. What did you see, girl? Looks like he's asleep. They're rotting hmm. away from the inside. In a few years, there won't be anything left. You saw rot on the inside. From the outside? Neat trick. Sounds like someone's been telling you stories about Ash Blight. Happened back when I was a kid. Oh. Would have lost most of the town if the old apothecary hadn't brewed up a batch of green leaf tonic. Can you make some? Do I look like an apothecary? Go ask June. She's the one who knows about this stuff. Charming fellow. So I guess that's going to be an aspect. Like, I'd have to go to June to and, make sure that gets fixed so that the apothecary can exist. Yeah, so I'm guessing that, uh, that, uh, that woman is June. Right there, to our left. I'm guessing that's June. Yes. Why would someone do this? This will take forever to sort out. Excuse me. I was wondering if you could help me. You and half the town? No, no, I can't. Someone tore the label off of my mushrooms. That sounds bad. Bad? It's terrible. One of these is red button. Good for digestion. Great on a salad. One of them is ground death cat. Even the tiniest bit could be deadly. An important distinction, wouldn't you agree? Of course, with no labels, it's impossible to tell them apart. Can't we just throw them out and make some more? Sure, of course. It would take weeks to find the mushrooms, days to prepare them. I don't have time to redo it all. My father used to do all of that. He bottled and labeled them years ago. I'm sorry. I wish I could help. Well, you could be, because he's alive on the left side of my screen. Exactly <laughs> what I was thinking. It would be nice to have help around here. Since Dad died, though, I try to keep everything the way he left it. But there are only so many hours in the day. Sorry, I've got to get back to work. No wonder she's upset. They all look alike. I suppose they do. Let me try some. So you want to look into the past. Right. I can't see them in the past at all. Allow me. Oh, are you going to give us a new thing? Press square to prepare a time hop. 
and then use the left thing to make Mateus hop to the past. All right, let's see what that does. All right, so there's the square. So you can hop to the past or the future. Aha! There he is! Oh, I can only move as Mateus. I guess I can't move as anyone else? Oh. Yeah, no, I hit something, but I don't know. Confirm? Is that what I'm doing? Oh, okay. Uh, I, yeah, I guess that's it. And there was something that was sparkly on the ground okay, here. Right. So X. Let's have him hop this way. And on the right, there was something sparkling on the ground. Oh, I see it. So it's the one on the right that's the healthy one. So I take this one? Well, this one has a skull on it. I imagine this is the death cap. Press square to prepare a time hop and then press X to make Matanus hop back to the present. That sticker! I saw it today! Some kids were playing with one. Okay, so until I at this point I'd want him to go back because I'd want to find those kids. But right. I think we're going to call this a video here, everyone, as the time is up, or it has been up, but I want to really explore this. Overall thoughts before we head out of here, Josiah. I, the mechanics in the game are very interesting. Um, I, I, think I, would, I think I would have a lot of fun with this. I'm not sure what the story will end up being, but the mechanics themselves are interesting enough that it would probably uh, get a, at least a few hours of play out of me. Um, I, I'm fairly certain I will pick this up, actually. Uh, I, I, uh, I, I have looked at it for a while. Like, I, I've known nothing other than the screenshots and maybe the trailer. Mm -hmm. But, uh, the, yeah, it's interesting. Uh, I, I didn't know about the time jumping mechanic. That, that was new to me. So uh, that is a fascinating uh, way and simple way to tell a story. Uh, so I think uh, this, this this has potential to be a really fun game. Yeah, it's a very unique game. Um, certainly, you could tell I was at least interested because, you know, when I go into these... I mean, the only, I always say when I do a Let's Try, I'm like, okay, it's about 10 minutes or maybe 15 minutes. And then in this case, we times it by two for a guest. And usually if I stay a little after, that's because I feel, you know, I, I at least either liked it or was interested in something in regards to it. Um, I think or I said twice that I would end the video and kept going just because I was interested. So, trust me, there have been Let's Tries where that 10 minute mark hits and I'm like, guess what, I'm done, later everyone. <laughs> so, yep. this was not one of those games. So, alright, I'll catch you next time for, I guess, more Let's Tries. Later everyone.